Good morning, you fine person sitting right there in that fine seat. In this fine world. Today's another day. It's Thursday for me. I'm in Winnipeg right now. They sent me into the city. We're trying to grab some stuff, put it in our trailer, and bring us where it needs to be. So let's get this day started. I hope you guys are all having a good day. I am. It's going to be a good day. All right, this Thursday, and we have gathered ourselves some goodies. Little goodies, and some big goodies, and some rubber goodies. Tires. 4,000 pounds of tires. Apparently. Apparently. Sounds like a lot. What if they fill them up with water? Can you imagine? Those are heavy tires. Maybe they're like solid. They don't look solid, don't they? I don't know, that's what the paperwork said. So those are all the goodies I have accumulated. Let's bring them to where they're supposed to be, shall we? They're not gonna deliver themselves. No, don't say it. They will not deliver themselves. That's what I do. So aside from those tires and uh, some boxes of goodies, we got one more package of goodies to pick up and then I believe we're gonna head out and uh, bring them to the people Take who the need next them. Left onto Bean Road, then turn left onto McPhillips Street North. Karen, we talked about this yesterday, didn't we? Or was it the day before? Uh, this way, I choose this way. Because this way is paved, that way is gravel. Let's take the pavement. Gotta go around the perimeter of Winnipeg. Got another one to pick up on the west side. Turn We're on the north on side right now. Street north, she said north, like McPhillips. Signs for McPhillips Street, Crossmore Avenue. There goes another good looking Pete. Look at that shiny. You guys want a trucker selfie? Let's pull in behind him. Everybody say cheese. Oh, I can't get close enough to actually see myself. <laughs> I'm not gonna tailgate him for that. But some people, uh, uh, some people, some, some of these tankers, they have a, a flatter back, I guess, and you can see yourself in the back of their shiny tanker. We call that a trucker selfie. It's another one of those beautiful jade trucks, and that. That, that place has got a nice looking fleet. So that is the little goodie that I had to pick up. It's gonna ride shotgun with me. Almost needed a forklift for this one. Good thing I'm still young and strong. It's gotta be at least five pounds. Oh, this guy was hilarious that I was delivering to here. Takes his skid steer out of the garage. He's doing donuts and starts drifting around the parking lot. Drifts around the trucks, comes around. He's obviously done this before. Comes around just perfectly. It <laughs> lines up with the pallet, grabs the pallet, backs up, does a donut with it, and drifts back into the garage. <laughs> well, you gotta have fun at work. You gotta have fun at work. That was some skill. Hashtag impressed. <laughs> it's like one fluid motion too. He didn't even really stop. Drifted around to the back of the trailer, came in, gently picked up his skid, backed up, started doing. It's like he was dancing. It was, it was art. It was skid steer art. It's awesome. All right. Next stop, Steinbach. Up. Oh, let's not drive behind people that are backing up.
got rid of all my goodies. These are the only things left. I am pretty sure they are giant go-kart wheels. But I might be wrong. Whatever go-kart that would go on, I would want to take it for a spin. How many tires we got here? Eight on here. Eight, 16, 24. 24 tires on there. So they're just trying to figure out uh, uh, how they're gonna get them off. I have a an outdoor dock that I'm backed up to here. But the trailer is about uh, four inches higher than their dock. So they're trying to find blocks so they can drive in here and just uh, pick them up and go. And get them off my back. I don't want them anymore. They're weighing me down. sweater for these warmer days at home today I thought about it as I was walking to the door and it was kind of cold in the morning I'm like you know what I'm not gonna need it today you know what morning Josh needs a smack in the back of the head morning Josh forgot that it gets warmer during the day because now afternoon Josh is sweating like a pig because morning Josh I don't need a sweater I don't need to go back inside I'm too lazy. Why would I go back inside? I already locked the door. Seriously, that's why I didn't go back and get it. I'm like, I already locked the door. I won't need it today, whatever. That's morning, Josh. Gonna have to have a talk with him. that which is all tucked in time to go home on the video I released yesterday I had quite a few comments saying that they weren't notified of that upload when they usually are uh, if you want to do me a favor uh, just make sure that you're still subscribed to my channel and make sure that the notification bell is still checked and let me know uh, today and then in the next couple of days if you're still not receiving notifications like you should be when my video is uploaded I'm just curious to see if that feature is working. I've heard from many people on many other channels that have had the same problems with it So just go and double check that if you can and uh, let me know if those notifications are actually working And we made it home Britt is working this evening and I'm gonna keep this video a little shorter I got to uh, do some work on my last video that was released was it today it was released yesterday it was the one that i had to upload like three times uh because i guess the youtube people kept thinking i was saying something that i wasn't so i had to go back and edit out that little piece and we're hoping fingers crossed it just released for the third time now hopefully they'll leave us alone and leave it up there and I'm not sure if that has anything to do with what I was talking about before why you guys aren't getting notified of my videos maybe that was just a random thing that'll be fixed today but uh, I'll look down below in the comments section and and see what you guys are saying if you got notified or not uh, if you haven't already do hit that bell see if it works I don't know some say it does some say it doesn't and we'll see you tomorrow take care everybody we kept today a little bit short